Good afternoon. It's Tuesday the 10th of March. Uh, it's just gone one o'clock and I'm back over on the looking for something special venue today. Um, arrived about a half an hour ago. Really warm today. Temperature's gone right up. Um, it's quite squally as well. It's a real warm breeze that's coming down. As per this time of year, can't see anything um, showing itself on a walk round, so I've opted for this particular swim as a best guess that I'm hoping some fish will be taking shelter from the wind in this particular area. Uh, fishing with two rods today, I've got one on a pop-up and I've got one on a bottom bait. Um, I'm on springers today uh, because I'm fishing near features so I'm expecting a drop back bite pretty tight to the features to be honest and uh, we're hoping we might get something this afternoon. I've only got a couple of hours this afternoon though I'm going to have to leave here by three o'clock because I've got to be elsewhere but hopefully a couple of hours in the right place if some fish are feeding will be good enough. We'll see. I've just flicked a couple of baits out round each rod and got time for anything else really, anything fancy. So we'll just have to see if we're in the right area and if we can get a fish. Yep. Oh. oh, that's pulling well. It's right over the other side. I've just seen its surface. See if I can get them away from there a bit. A few tree branches and stuff that I don't want that getting into. I was going to have to go shortly because I'm I'm pretty sure it must be about. 20 to 3 now, quarter to 3, and as I said, I'd got to be away by 3 o'clock, and uh, I really didn't think it was going to happen. I had a few um, bleeps on this rod a little while ago. Uh, I was fishing on a pop up on this rod, and I changed it over um, to a bottom bait because nothing materialised, and uh, It's alright, better concentrate on what I'm doing a minute. It's still a long way out and it's it's heading round the corner here. And as I said, I had a, a couple of bleeps on the rod. I didn't think much was going to happen. Um, changed over. And it's, it's just took off now. And here I am playing. This will be the second fish I've played of 2020. Unfortunately, the other one did get away. As I said uh, the last time I was over here. Right, I better look for a landing net. <sighs> Doesn't look bad, it looks like it's um, a common, I think. Dark one though. Come on. Yes, and it's in. <laughs> oh.
There we go, first fish in the net of 2020 carp wise. Oh, we might be able to unhook him in the net actually. Yes, that's handy. Not massive, but it'll do. Right, I'll get the stuff ready and I'll get that weighed. Oh, oh, nearly fell in. Right, I've just had it on the scales. 15 pound four ounce. Lovely, but once again, the most important thing, it's absolutely beautiful. Rather leached up, but then you would expect at this time of year because they, they have been laying around an awful long time. I've only got, got the travel mat with me today, so I do need to be careful. Right, there we go, 15 pound four. Absolute beauty, mouth perfect once again. That'll do. Just have a very quick look at the other side. There we go, very pleased with that. I'll get that slip back. Right, as you can see, I've made a few new friends as well. I am going to have to end the vlog there, it's now 50, uh, 8 minutes past 3, or 15.08 I was going to say, and as I said I did need to get away at 3 o'clock, I'm already running late. So only very quick, I know, but there you are, that's how it goes sometimes. Once again, thank you for watching, and until the next time, all the best with your angling.